Boom shakalaka. What is going on everybody? Randall here from Crypto Love and yes, another fireside chat or maybe an island beachside chat for Ethereum Classic. My thoughts. Now, before we get started, just want to say thank you to everyone subscribing. Thank you for mashing on the like button. And make sure uh, to leave a comment on this video if you want to win a shirt. But Ethereum Classic, what do I think? Ooh, I have mixed feelings, but in general, they're good. So to begin with, for those of you who don't know, Ethereum Classic came out of one of the largest crimes in cryptocurrency history a few years back. So the DAO attack, the DAO hack, basically on Ethereum, uh, it was not a problem with Ethereum itself. It was an ICO, the DAO, on Ethereum that got hacked for $50 million. Boom. At that time, it was on the blockchain. It's supposed to be immutable. Well, they said, hey, a crime has been committed. This is not immutable. We're going to fork this, create Ethereum and Ethereum Classic. So basically, Ethereum is the one where they did away with that hack happening. Ethereum Classic is the old chain where that hack did happen, the immutable blockchain, all right? Um, and so that's kind of how Ethereum, Ethereum Classic came about. Now, Ethereum Classic as it is today, not much different from Ethereum other than just, you know, popularity, right? All the ICOs coming out on Ethereum, they all want to be ERC-20 tokens, easily plug and play that's the big name brand as opposed to being the ethereum classic the erc223 tokens okay not much of a difference there they're both storable on ethereum wallets okay no big difference there um in terms of the teams the development ethereum somewhat centralized being led by the ethereum foundation okay ethereum classic decentralized has a lot of different teams some of them you might you might have heard of like iohk from cardano okay but there is some other stuff. So in terms of Ethereum versus Ethereum Classic, eh, not much of a difference there. The big thing, the big thing that I think that Ethereum Classic has in potential for it is some news that was just recently announced where Coinbase said they will soon be adding Ethereum Classic. Now, as we know right now, Ethereum has four coins on it. Bitcoin, Bcash, Ethereum, and Litecoin. Well, guess what? They're adding Ethereum Classic. And you know what? Ethereum Classic is going to be the least expensive of those options right now. Now, this is just ballpark. Bitcoin's like 6,700, Bcash like 1,000, Ethereum like 450, Litecoin like $75, Ethereum Classic about $15, okay? Well, if you think back to December and January, when everybody knew wanted to get into cryptocurrency, where'd they go? They went to Coinbase, okay? So they want to buy Bitcoin, but that was too expensive. It was $20,000. They want to buy Ethereum, but that was too expensive. That was like $1,500. So they bought Litecoin, the cheapest option at the time. Okay. Same thing is going to happen next time there's a giant, um, not an exodus, but people coming to cryptocurrency. Okay. The next time that happens, guess what? My opinion is that everyone's going to go to ETH Classic because that's going to be the cheapest coin on Coinbase. And that's the one that they'll go for. Now, that's just my opinion. But because of that, I think that there's good things coming for Ethereum Classic. Now, also, I mean, on their roadmap, they have stuff for solving scalability, a thousand transactions per second, different things like that. So they do have those things coming up right now. Not much of a difference between Ethereum Ethereum Classic. So I think potentially undervalued compared with the other four cryptocurrencies listed on Coinbase. And as of yet, it hasn't been listed there. So I think there's potential to pick it up at a discount before it gets listed on there, before everybody starts buying it up on Coinbase. But that's just my opinion. And that's just this little beachside chat. Me just chilling on the beach with a beard. All right, cool. So hope you guys enjoyed that. Let me know what you think down below. I'll catch you in the next one. P -p 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 Peace.